Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. As you can see, it is a collective haul and the first one I've done across all these three brands in some time. So if you want more of these, make sure you subscribe and come and follow me over on Instagram, Twitter and Snapchat. Do people still use that? I don't know. Well, I'll put it there anyway. Um, for more video content on here and for more sort of day by day updates on my stories on Instagram and just my crazy tweets basically. But yeah, I have a collective haul for you. I've picked up loads of stuff from Zara, H&M and ASOS, which is the first in a while. So I wanted to show you guys what I got. So the top that I'm actually wearing is ASOS. I'm just gonna do up my trousers because embarrassment. Um, so it's this, this cropped black um, top, very simple, nothing much to it. I'm wearing it with these like leather look joggers from Zara. Um, many many hauls back um but it's got the thumb holes which i've been waiting for as you guys know Woo, my hands are dry <laughs> let me sit down um so yeah i am a huge fan of this i picked this up in the same asos order that i got the next item that i'm about to show you i love it it's just perfect for like lounging around the house an outfit like this i'll give you like the full look just so you guys can see it on but huge fan huge fan um, the other thing I picked up from ASOS were a pair of boots. So I've been on the lookout for some black leather or faux leather over the knee boots just to kind of match my Stuart Wiseman boots but in a slightly more wearable fabric because it rains a lot here so suede boots, not very practical. Um, so I picked up these. So I actually came across these on Sophie Moulds instagram and then youtube i commented on her photo and she told me that she got them from asos so they were only 32 pounds they don't look as nice here like they look i don't know they look a bit weird but on amazing amazing i told you so i picked them up in like a size five and a size six because size six was sold out at the time that i bought them this is the size five way too small so when I do the try on for you guys, I'll do it with the size sixes that I'm actually going to keep. With. So these bad boys are going back. Okay, so up next is Zara. I know you guys will be highly, highly interested in that. Um, so I didn't get much to be fair. Um, I just picked up, this is just like refreshing my autumn winter wardrobe to be honest. Um, so I picked up another top. This doesn't have thumb holes, but I could probably put some in here. I'm very determined with the thumb holes because it's not about being cold this season. Um, this really cute crop top um, is $9.99. It's very creased. It's been in here for a while. And it um, just looks like this. It's kind of got like a gathering detail in the middle um, and some really long sleeves. It's in a chocolate brown. Everyone's loving chocolate brown this season, apparently. <laughs> so that was that. And then I also picked up, oh my goodness, all of this stuff is creased. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm not going to iron it for the try -ons. Um, This double-breasted blazer in beige. This was $69.99 and I got it in an extra small. All items will be linked down below. But this, as an outfit with this, yes, 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 yes. So I will try all of that on for you. Um... So that is Zara, and then from H&M I went a little bit crazy, um, so I wanted to see what other aviator jackets they had in store, so I found this one. I know there's probably like cheaper dupes that you can get from places like Shein and Pretty Little Thing and Boohoo and stuff, but I do like the quality of H&M stuff, but you can't beat that. So. Yeah, I just picked up this, it's like a, maybe it's like a shearling um, coat that just looks like that. Um, I got it in an extra small, I can't remember the price, but I will link it down below for you guys. And I will try it on for you as well, probably with that chocolate brown, chocolate brown top. And you guys can see that on with the trackies as well, because I think that's, that's quite a nice look. So I got that. Um, I also picked up another knit um just because i keep picking up polo necks guys and i think we've established that they are not for me 
I need to I need to let the dream go but this one's quite thin so maybe it could work but anyway it just looks like that um nice and long sleeve like just a gray standard gray color I will link it below for you but I picked it up in a size UK extra small and it was 17.99 that's the first time I've seen pricing on the HM logo so I'm not 100% sure if that is a keep or send back but I'll let you know then I got another pair of boots because that was before I found the ASOS ones um, but I just thought I'd try these on for size so they are just below the knee oh no <laughs> it's going to be a no I'm pretty sure but I will try them on for you guys because I'm not I'm not a pagan um, but yeah they just look like that they do look sexy but the kitten heel it's the kitten heel for me <laughs> I don't know I actually don't know but you'll see them on, you'll see them styled up, probably with the outfit with the sort of chocolate crop top and the aviator jacket and these. I'll let you, you'll see. Anyway, so that is everything from my collective haul. I will link all items down below as well as sizes. If I can't find something or it's sold out, I'll put something similar down below. Um, in the description box, you can find links to my social media pages. You can find links to my filming equipment, should you want to start your own channel um, and what you'll also find is a link to a Instagram page called Umilele Jewels and this is a new brand that somebody very close to me has just started up so I want you guys to all go over there and follow the page they launch on Black Friday which is the 27th of November so in about two weeks from now and you guys are going to love some of the jewellery pieces. I'm going to be rocking them in some upcoming videos and probably more so after the launch or like just leading up to it but please 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 head over there and follow, comment on the last post and just let them know that you came from this video. So um, I will be checking. <laughs> Um, but yeah, amazing, incredible startup black owned jewellery brand and I want us to give it all the support that it deserves. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to go film the try on clips, let's just keep it real. And I will see you in my next video which will probably be a vlog. Um, a very long vlog, probably centred around like lockdown too because I've kind of been like documenting what I've been getting up to. So yeah, tune in for that um, I'll probably get it up this time next weekend, if not the weekend after. Okay guys, take care, stay safe, and I will see you soon. Bye!